Santa Maria announced several upcoming community events to go along with recently added public services. And News Channel reporter Dave Alley looks at what's in store. July is a busy time for Santa Maria. It's summertime and there's a lot of programs and services that the city of Santa Maria is offering for residents and residents who live nearby. Who are invited to take part in a number of upcoming offerings, such as the Summer Splash this Sunday afternoon. This is a really good opportunity to enjoy the Paul Nelson Aquatic Center free of charge and it's here at the uh, right in the center of the community so everybody can come out and enjoy the pool. Also on Sunday the city continues its two month long concerts in the park series. We have some great summer concerts in the park going on at a Rotary Centennial Park and Aquist Apache Park here in Santa Maria. A great variety of different styles and genres. At the library there's a great variety of free events going on providing a little something for everyone. We have programs for all ages. Come into the library, check out our online calendar. We have a physical calendar here at the library. See what we have to offer and see anything that might pique, pique your interest. Santa Maria Regional Transit is now providing expanded routes focused on Broadway, helping out with summertime demand. Along that corridor, we've already taken steps to double the frequency along that route. So there'd be buses coming around every 20 minutes as opposed to every 45. And also new modernized open air bus shelters. It also helps with the visibility of a rider, of both seeing when the bus is coming and for our bus drivers to see the passenger. Uh, outfitted within them also is uh, solar powered lighting, and many of them will also, also have real time information signs on them. Another recently added service is free public Wi Fi here at Grogan Park, part of Santa Maria's ongoing effort to provide network connectivity at city facilities. We are continuing to roll more of these locations out uh, strategically and so we'll make more announcements in the months ahead. At the end of this month, Santa Maria is holding a blood drive near City Hall. All the blood stays locally here in Santa Maria and there's a dire need for blood right now. You can save one to three lives with a single donation and it's, it's well worth it. So be sure to mark your calendar and be ready to get in on all the action. In Santa Maria, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley.